I once asked somebody, how many second chances does a man need to turn his life around? Ever since I was a kid, I ran these streets by whatever means necessary. South Minneapolis belonged to me. All of it. I was never a prince. Always a king. So what's it like? Being king. Kings, right? Yeah. Name what you think it is. Maybe you need some help. I look like I need any help. Only kind of help you get in here, boy, is the kind you get for yourself. We all on our own in here. That's it. That's it. In prison, you learn to watch your back, which can leave you exposed from other sides, like the one right in front of you. Who did this? Who did this to you, Hanks? The victim says it was turnip seed. Lock turnip seed down. What? says here and Andre Hanks is the one accusing you. Hanks? He's lying. It ain't true. John, it doesn't matter if it's true. He says it is. He even claims he's got eyewitnesses. Look, you're halfway through a seven-year sentence. You don't need this right now. I didn't do nothing. He's lying. He's trying to get back at me because... Look, you gotta believe me. I'm getting framed here. Then you give me the names. The names of the guys who beat and raped him. Wait. I can't do that. Then we could be in some real trouble, John. Hate! Turn around! You gotta tell the truth, boy. Tell the truth. I'll protect you. It's too late for that. So you just gonna lie? You gonna turn me in? Big bad John Turnseed. The king. Walking around hell while the rest of us get burned. You gotta do the right thing, man. What? Like you? You watched them grab me and pull me down there. I saw you, and I begged you to help. I begged you, but you turned, and you did nothing. One word from you, and they would have stopped. So I did what you told me to do. We're all in here on our own, right? I'm sorry, all right? I should have stopped them. I should have. We're all in here on our own, John. This is my life you messing with, man! Let's go, John. We're all in here on our This is my life you messing with! You better tell the truth! All eyes were on me. And the king had to show his kingdom he wasn't no snitch. Is the state ready? Uh, yes, Your Honor. Uh, 
Um, Your Honor? Due to new evidence, we're gonna need to recall the defendant. On what grounds? My client says he lied. He perjured himself. That's what the witness is saying, y uh, yes. How do we know he's not lying right now? Because it's the truth. John had shut, nothing to shut, do with it. I was just trying to get back what? at you. I'm sorry, John. I'm sorry, John. This entire process has been a huge miscarriage of justice. My client is prepared to sue the state for his treatment. I don't know if you want that. What kind of deal do you want, Linda? Well, we could go through the process of litigation, filing lawsuits with the state, but that might cast an unfortunate light on the conditions in the prison. There could be investigations, questions. What do you want? Time served is sufficient for such an egregious miscarriage of justice, don't you think? Do you have anything to say? Uh, never mind. I agree with the defense. Mr. Turnipseed, on behalf of the state of Minnesota and the entire legal profession, I would like to apologize for what's happened here today. I am hereby dismissing the assault charges and commuting the current sentence to time served. You, sir, are free to go. Say again. It was the first time I got a second chance. It wasn't the last. Sometimes one second chance isn't enough. They kept coming. I ain't know what to do with them all. Or maybe I did, I just didn't care. That's when he showed up. Mark. Art Erickson. Jesus freak. Craziest white fool I ever knew. And the only one in the neighborhood. My hood. I don't care who you are. Get off my street. But he never did get off my street. Seemed like everywhere I went, he was there. was persistent. I'll give him that. You kidding me, man? You kidding me? Get out of here. Give me the ball. And as I kept getting out, he kept coming around. Man, who are you? Huh? Some white man trying to save the poor black man. I care about a man's color, Johnny. And... Well, I care about a man's wallet. And yours is about to be mine if you don't get up out of here. He never would listen to me, so I started listening to him. Tried to go legit, got clean, got a wife and kids, got a real job teaching computers. But living like an ex-con, it's kind of like living like an ex-drug addict. As soon as you stop, you can't wait to start again. You might pretend to be something else. But you know deep down what you really are. And that's when all my second chances ran out. I was caught. It was all a lie. I was finally going to be exposed as the rat I really was. All those chances to get it right were gone. Come out of the office, Johnny. Let's go. And I was ashamed. Finally ashamed. I don't need your help. One day, John, you're going to get tired of doing this on your own. And that's when you're going to pray. 
and you're going to find God right where you left him. You ready to make it stop? It'll always be your choice. Always. Please make it stop. Please make it stop. All right, we're coming in. All right, guys, let's go. Go, 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 go. Coming in. Hey, don't shoot me. I'm coming out. Mr. Turnipseed. Your Honor, do you know how many times you have appeared in my courtroom, Mr. Turnipseed? I kind of lost count, sir. Fifteen. I remember because each time, over and over again, you seem to be let off the hook because of missed opportunities, blown evidence career politicians, and let's face it, a broken system. A broken system ain't my fault, sir. I have been trying to figure out why you keep coming back to my courtroom. And then it clicked. You're scared. Excuse me? Yeah, that's why you keep coming back. It's not that you're trying to get out of prison so much as trying to get back into prison because you're scared of what's out there. You're scared of having to change. You don't want it. Is that so? I've been asked to issue some kind of harsh sentence. Let's think about this. If I let you back into prison, I'm giving you everything you want. So, I'm letting you go. What? I'm letting you go. I'm releasing you. You're guilty, John. And I'm sentencing you to go out there and change. Turn your life around. So, go. Do it. Oh, one more thing, John. You walk in my courtroom one more time, just, just one more time, and um, you'll spend the rest of your life in a tiny cell with no windows, no cable TV, where you'll be the ruler of nobody but yourself and the hole in which you crap. You will not see another human being for as long as you breathe. If you want to be nobody, I can make you nobody. You want to be somebody, really somebody? Do it. Johnny! The judge is an old friend of mine. I heard you were getting out. What? You gonna help me or something? Maybe. What's in it for you? Nothing. It just so happens that second chances are my specialty. And how many second chances does a man need? This one, if he uses it right. Come on, we'll get someone to eat. <laughs> 